Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing my July favorites, so let's get into it. So, I've been loving the Bath & Body Works White Citrus Fine Fragrance Mist. I actually have had this for a while now, and I've just been finally starting to use it, and it's already down that much. I've also been loving the Wild Apple Daffodil Shimmer Mist, Bath & Body Works. I've, like I said, the same thing with that one. I've had this one for a while now, and it's, I've just finally started to use it this month, and it's already down that low. Um, I've also been loving the Bath & Body Works Fresh Picked Farmstead Apple Simple Fresh Good Hand Cream. I've been using this this month, too. Um, I didn't want to put any of the favorites that I put in my June, but I did want to recall some of them just in case you didn't see that one. Um, I've been loving the CoverGirl Alice Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 and 810. I've been loving the Rimmel London Stay Matte Long Lasting Press Powder in Natural. I've been loving the NYX Eyeshadow Base in White. I apply this before I put my eyeshadow on. I've been loving the NYC Big Bold Mascara. This is in black. And I don't think I mentioned these on my last one, but I've been loving the Hard Candy Lash Tinsel Glitter Mascara, Orion's Belt. I really want to get the black one of this because it'll go perfect with my mascara, but I mean it still looks good. I have it on right now. I've also got this new eyeshadow palette. It's LA Colors Little Black Book of Eyeshadow Smoky Edition. I've just been using the colors only for like a simple look. I've just been using one of them and putting them on. Um, so that's all for like the products. Um, I've been actually working out a lot this month, so I've been loving Zumba 2. I have all the Zumba games, um, but this is definitely my favorite. I The games I've been playing have been The Sims 3. I have all of The Sims 3 games, except a couple of them. Um, I'm loving... Um, the candle I've been loving this month has been Pineapple Mango Fresh Picked, and it smells amazing. I've been burning this every day. So the books that I really wanted to talk about, this is why the video would be longer. Um, I've been loving Bobbi Brown Makeup Manual. I don't really know a lot about makeup, I just know what I've seen from YouTube, and I kind of wanted to get to know more about it. So I've been buying books on makeup, hair, nails, skincare. So that's why I wanted to share this book and I have another book to share. The one thing I did really want to talk about is that if you're not sure when to get rid of makeup, like I don't want to read this, but like a liquid and cream foundation, two years, that's when you throw it away. Concealer, two years, powder, two years, mascara, six months. Lipstick 12 to 18 months. There's a lot more, but I won't go on about it. Um, I have Dalia. This one. I have that book. This one, I think I like more than the Bobbi Brown one. This one, it starts right away with the skincare basics. See, this is how I figured out how what I need. So, like, I have oily, so I need... A gel facial cleanser. For toner, I need an astringent to remove impurities. I need a water-based or oil-free gel. And then for protecting, like, you know, sun sunscreen, I need oil-free or lightweight gel. But this is the one I fell in love with more than the Bobbi Brown one. But it's also nice to get another opinion on things. And it's pretty much all of the same thing, though. So, But it's also, this one also tells you... For depending on your skin type, like mine is oily, like I already said, um, the foundation, a certain foundation is good for you to use. So like mine liquid, liquid is good for normal to oily skin. Powder is good for very oily skin and blotchy skin. 
So that's that one. So my favorite app of this month has been Pinterest. My Pinterest is Fun Size Beauty with Two Eyes. So if you want to, you can follow me on there and you can look at all of the things that I've been pinning. So I am currently editing my video right now, as you can see if it shows on there. Um, my video was supposed to be longer this time because I did miss Monday's video. And that's only because I wanted to make my July favorites longer. But now that I'm editing it, it's getting shorter. So I did forget to mention like my lip and hair products. So I will be talking about those. And I did actually um, change my blush. So, so let's start with the lip products first. So I've been using the Maybelline Baby Lips Crystals. This is pink quartz and I have it on right now and I been loving the NYX butter gloss peaches and cream and this is what that one looks like the I like to always put like a lip gloss over it I've been loving lately the Mary Mistletoe Liplicious lip gloss this is from Bath and Body Works sorry about the dogs um, my favorite hair product this month has been the Aussie Sprunch Catch the Wave Hairspray Fixative Scrunch and Go for a Casual Carefree Style. This is what that one looks like. And the new blush that I've been using has been the Femme Couture Mineral Effects Loose Blush. It's in Sweet Blush. And this is what that one looks like. So that's all of the stuff. I hope you guys liked the video. Please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to see something, comment down below to do it. So thank you for watching. Bye.